Ah, the great outdoors. Snow's fallen, the air is cold, and avalanches are all around. So an avalanche is a technical term. It means a big slide of snow. Now, avalanches can get huge. We're talking hundreds of thousands and millions of tons of snow can get moved around in one of these things. They can take out buildings, they can destroy cars, they can kill people. Avalanches are these just hugely destructive forces of nature. And they're totally awesome. All avalanches start with a mass of unstable snow. An avalanche happens when you have a weak layer of snow underneath a strong layer of snow. It's kind of like the setup I got here. I have these yellow cups that are representing a weak layer. Uh, you know, I can, I can push down on them and they stay in place okay. But the second I try and push them down slope, they topple right over. And they're not connected together, they don't really have any strength of their own. Now, I have this plastic lid, and it is like a strong layer of snow. It's tough, it stays together, it's not coming apart. Now, I can put the strong layer on, of snow on top of the weak layer of snow, and it's hanging on, but just barely. This is a recipe for disaster, so let's see what happens when we add some weight to this setup. How are we going to trigger our demonstration avalanche here? Well, I'm a storm, and I'm going to throw a bunch of snow weight on top of the strong snow, and it's going to overload it. Storm away! Do you see that? Do you see I made, I made the strong layer slide over the weak layer. The weak layer totally collapsed, and the whole slope just went. It's science! A snow avalanche is a mass of unstable snow set into motion by a number of contributory causes. Now, you don't have to have a storm to cause an avalanche. You can have any number of triggers, like, say, for example, a skier. I'm a skier. I'm going to trigger an avalanche. Same thing, collapse the weak layer and the strong layer slid. I'm here in the mountains of Utah and we've had about a meter of snowfall. It's really deep right now and there's a lot of load on that weak layer. So I'm gonna see if I can set off a miniature avalanche. <sighs> Do you see that? You see the the strong layer kind of slid as one until it got broken up by bumps on the slope. Science replay.